What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug and today I'm going to do a quick review on my brand new Honeywell Wi-Fi thermostat. All right, I want to show you real quick my wiring. Now, what I would suggest you do, um, it comes with the box. You have these little sticker thingies here. If I were to do it again, I would go ahead and um, label these wires so that when I take my old one off, my new ones are, are labeled. I just took a picture with my cell phone and that worked, but these stickers, I didn't even know they were in there because I'm a guy. I just opened it and just you know, just went to <laughs> installing it. <laughs> oh, and by the way, guys, I got this from QVC, um, but Amazon sells this. I'll put the Amazon link in the description. Um, it's it's slightly under $200. Uh, on QVC, it was $200. I got this on FlexPay, but on Amazon, I think it's like 180 or something like that. But I looked at all of them and this caught my eye. This passed my eye test. I think it looks sexy on my wall. It kind of matches my paint. Oh, and you can change the color to, of the screen. They have like dozens of colors you can change it to, but this is the standard color. It works with my scheme. I'm going to paint this this weekend. I'm just going to take my time. I've I have I've had this less than a week, guys. So, yeah. Anywho, as you can see, it's kind of warm in here. So, why don't we turn on some air real quick. So um, as you may know from the title that this works with your Alexa devices, you know, your Amazon Bluetooth speaker thingies, whether it be the dot or the, the tab or the echo or even the echo show, they all work with this. And I think that's pimp like, let me give you guys a quick demo now. Let's see, turn on AC. I don't know if you heard it. I'm, I got to turn it up. It's in my kitchen, my um, Echo Show. But you see that? See the status change? Let me go ahead and turn it up. Volume eight. All right. So it, it automatically um, turned on because I turned on the AC and it was automatically set to 75. But let's say um, I'm going to set it to, so it's at 80. I'll, send, I'll set it to 77. Watch this. Set AC to 77. The AC is set to 77. So it takes a couple of seconds to change, but as you can see right here, it changed. Now I can do all of this manually. Um, you know, it works the same way with the heat. Um, let's see, turn off AC. It's off. See how quick it changes, see? Well, we'll go ahead and turn on the heat and move on. Turn on the heat. It's set to heat. Let's see how long, see? Turn heat to 85. Sorry, what device? Oops. Change thermostat to 85. The heat set to 85. Turn heat off. It's off. All right, now we can do this on any device, <clears throat> Amazon device throughout my house. I have one in my bedroom. 
in my son's playroom, of course, in my kitchen, as you just saw. So this is completely awesome. And as you know that this has a um, app for your cell phone, your Android, I mean, or your tablets, and of course your uh, PC. So you can, um, you can operate this remotely. And what I like about the phone app, which I'm gonna show you in a second, um, you can operate this through Wi-Fi or your data connection or your data um, plan uh, through your um, you know cell phone company. So either way, it's not like you have to have Wi-Fi. So once you set this up to your Wi-Fi um, and you can do it straight from this, then you're good to go. You'll log in to your um, to the app that it says it, it'll direct you in here where to go. And then you just log in, sign in. And there's gonna you're gonna have to put in your um, thermostat's unique ID. It's a bunch of numbers and letters. And once you do that, you have a username and password, and you're good to go. And before we go to the app, I want to show you some things, um, some options that you may have. I have mine on automatic, but you can change that. We go to system. So this is how you manually do stuff. So if I wanted to turn it on the air, I hit cool and hit done and then adjust my temperature. It's the menu. So the cool thing about these Wi-Fi thermostats, it's not unique to this one. It's pretty much all of them. You can schedule when the, you know, when the air or the heat comes on and off throughout the week and certain times of the day. Um, I didn't do that yet. I will get to that later. Probably this weekend when I get to play around with it. And actually what I really want to do is um, kind of do a journal of the times um, when I'm turning on the air or like, or especially at night, what temperature I feel cool with or me and Ashton feel, you know, comfortable with in the winter and in the summer. And then, then, you know, once I have all of that, I'll go ahead with that um, schedule. All right. So I just want to give you a quick visual of that. All right. All right, guys, let me show you what the app looks like. Um, let's see. See it right there, thermostat, Honeywell thermostat. So I click it. Oh, I had it on airplane mode. Let me change that. I'm sorry. All right, let me click it again. See? So the device is off. I go to system. I can go to cool. Submit. And that'll turn on the, the air. At some point, it, it takes a couple seconds to kick in. I went ahead and changed my cool set point. And I just heard the air come back on. So I did this again remotely from my phone. You, It doesn't have to be Wi-Fi. It could be just your regular you know, data plan. It doesn't have to be Wi-Fi. Once it's set up again, once the thermostat is set up to, to your um, system, your Wi-Fi, your internet system, or should I say your home network, then you're good to go. So I'll show you that. That's the fan. This is the scheduling. You can do all of that through the phone. I'll let you guys it in settings. Let's see settings. Oh, not much there. Um, because I have my Amazon devices, guys, I don't really mess around with my um phone app I do everything through Alexa so but this will be useful you know like when I go on vacation or if I'm out of my house for long periods of time I can turn off my thermostat or I can turn it on you know whatever have you but when I'm not home I could just leave it off and when I'm about you know when I'm about to come back home I can turn it on but enough boring you my lunch breaks over and I gotta get back to work so anyway, hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. And also, I'm going to put some um, some things I think you should know in the description. Um, this was just an easy, brief 
uh, review. I mean, I have a cooking channel. This is not an electronics channel, but I'll leave some key information in the description that I think will be helpful to you. Um, that'll help you out. But anyway, thanks for just looking at my video. Remember to subscribe and we out.